Chevron just reporting this morning, earnings coming in at $2.55 a share. That missed the street's estimates by a lot. The estimates were $2.93. The company says that second quarter earnings decreased compared to last year, mostly because of lower margins on refined product sales. Also, though, higher taxes that they're looking at with this, a well write-off, and operational downtime at some of their assets. The street may not have known about some of those things, but they're going to find out today. Revenue coming in at $51.18 billion. That is better than expectations. Global production up by 11% this quarter. That compares to the year ago period. Uh, the stock right now, Joe, what are you seeing on your machine? It I mean, I like think that's right. It, it, it's uh, 150.50 is to 152.88. Right what is not right is what you see that spiked there, obviously. It, it, I'm sure there wasn't. That a, looks like it was last night. This, this well, was 150.50 just came in. Well, so I mean, there wasn't a real it. trade at yeah. 160. Yeah. So uh, that'd be a decline spiking. of 1.4% right now. Mm -hmm. uh, we're going to take through a lot of these things. We knew that uh, WTI prices were weaker through the course of the quarter. We'll hear what ExxonMobil has to say as well. And Chevron CEO Mike Worth is going to join us to talk about this in the 8 o'clock hour. That is first on CNBC. Of course, the other big story is the arbitration matter between these two with the assets at Hess. Um, that is going to arbitration. We'll continue to hear more from each of them about what's taking place with that, too. It didn't work out where they could actually um, negotiate between the two of them, so they're taking it to arbitration.